So here we are. A thief, an assassin, two thugs, and a maniac. One of the main things I wanted to do with Guardians of the Galaxy was to create a universe that was very broad and very colorful, but that in the details was flawed and very specific. I will destroy you and your world. At Offensive Quinn, though it's not an offensive question, wants to know, uh, James Gunn, what villains, comic or cinematic, inspired how Ronan conducts villainy? We sort of think of Ronan as almost like a cosmic Hitler, so I would say Hitler is the most, uh, and, and a little bit of Osama bin Laden. When you say you knew, I think you're hurt. Mm -hmm. yeah. You know what I mean? You knew. You knew. Yeah. JB Honeybee, I'd love to know about Ronan and Nebula's costumes. The details are incredible. It was very difficult to create costumes that were not human and yet real. The costumes of Ronan and Nebula in particular, her full costume and look, I was in love with that character and that look and actually was in search of an actor who could fit that, you know, it, it had to be a tall, slim person. And I was, at the end, I was like, who is that actress? It, yeah, and people are like, Amy Pond from Doctor Who is that same character? It's I know. Like, and I, I love that. I love, and I love doing that to people, you know. You know, I love when people see my brother was Kirk on the Gilmore Girls for seven years show up as Yondu's first mate. You got any other cute little buggers like this? And I like to stick them all in a row on my control console. I can't tell if you're joking or not. He's being fully serious. G.B. Loftus wants to know, how important was it to you that adapting the comics was done so faithfully? It's not completely Faithful. I mean, the Yandu, the Yandu philosophy and the Yandu attitude is there, uh, but we've changed the, the wardrobe, the look, Yandu's fin is, has been clipped a bit. Why did you do it? Why did I change yeah. the shark fin? Because it, we drew initial designs of him with a shark fin, and as some people might expect, Michael Rooker with a big, huge shark fin on his head looks pretty goofy. It's funny, the comic book fans have really rallied behind the movie and they've been excited about everything they've seen, even the changes right. of the things that, have, that, that we've made to the characters. Something good, something bad, a bit of both. Varsity Vixen wants to know, I'm guessing asking him to marry me is a no? You know, at this point in time, I would say I don't know Varsity Vixen very well. And, uh, you know, it was a very nice Twitter handle. Um, but uh, at this point, I'm going to have to pass. Should I go ahead and buy a second ticket to see Guardians of the Galaxy back to back? Guardians is definitely designed for, for re-watching. There's so much stuff in the background, so much stuff happening. If you watch Groot throughout the movie and just watch Groot, he's doing so many things that you've you know, missed the first time around. I, I, but I would suggest maybe five or six tickets. You know, just keep going Absolutely. for a day. I, I would agree. Yeah. And I think they should all be purchased right here at Arclight. Yeah, at Arclight. <laughs> yeah, come and see it at Arclight. We're the frickin' Guardians of the Galaxy. I'm with them.